What's up everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Anthony here. So we're sitting outside of a Goodwill. We're going to head inside and see if we can find anything to sell, make a little money. So come along. Heading out of that Goodwill now. Actually did find a few things, so we'll take a look at it when we get back. All right, guys, we are back at home. I actually did find a few things, nothing crazy. It was just a small haul. I think I spent around $12, and I should be able to turn that into about $120, $130 before fees. I'll just quickly show you what I got, what I paid for it, and what I think I can sell it for. So first off, just picked up this little Sony 8mm tape. Now, obviously, this isn't worth a lot on its own. I paid $0.69 cents for it. I usually just pick these up when I see them, and then... You know, once I have a few, I lot them up and sell them that way. And then I picked up this little Dymo Rhino label cartridge right here. Um, this was kind of a gamble, but it was only 99 cents and it was brand new. So I picked it up right now. The buy box price is like $37, but the rank is crazy in tools. It's like over 2 million. So I don't think it'll sell for that, but for 99 cents, you know, I figured I'd grab it and price it at 15 or 20 bucks. And if it doesn't sell, I'll just lower it till it does. No big loss there. And then we have this little plug-and-play Jack's Pac-Man game. Turns on and everything, so 
shouldn't have any battery corrosion. I normally don't even look these up when I buy them. This was $2.99. Right now it's ranked about 6,000 in video games and the lowest FBA price is 30 bucks. But the next lowest FBA price is $49.99, which sounds about right. You know, I usually get between 30 and 40 bucks for these, so that should be a pretty decent quick seller right there. This isn't even one of the best ones, but always look out for these older Pac-Man plug-and-play games. Some of them do really well, and they're great FBA items. I think everything I found I'll probably be able to sell on Amazon FBA, just to try to get a bit of a higher price. This one, I'm not so sure. This is a, a little handheld electronic Yahtzee game. This one's from 2002, and I'm having trouble finding the exact listing for it. And the closest one I found, the lowest FBA price, is $54.95 used, with a rank of about 207000 But it's not the exact one, so I won't use that listing. If I can't find it, I'll just throw it on eBay or something. But it was, it was also $0.99, cents and it powers on and works. And then these Bop It games, these are always quick little flips. Uh, this one was $2.99. This is the Bop It Smash, and right now... It's ranked about 200,000 in toys as well. And the lowest FBA price for collectible condition is uh, 40 bucks or so. So not a bad little flip right there. All the boppets go for different prices, but at a couple bucks, they're usually definite pickups. And the last thing I picked up is this little first alert smoke detector thing, brand new sealed. However, I'm restricted in new condition. I paid $1.99 for it. In new condition, it's selling for about $29.99 with a rank of about 15,000 in home improvement but even in like new condition which i can sell it in and i'll just say that the packaging is a little worn i mean it's not really but that's what i'll say and so right now the lowest fba price in like new condition is 26.86 for a dollar 99 that's a definite decent little buy right there so that's everything i got like i said nothing crazy but i should be able to sell everything for between 100 and 130 dollars uh before shipping and fees and like I said, I paid $12, so not bad for a few minutes worth of work. So that's what I got for you today. If you like this type of video, make sure you leave a comment down below, like the video, and please subscribe to the channel. It's definitely appreciated. Otherwise, I will see you next time. Bye.